each question that is not answered correctly, you will be having to take a bite of this chili. Okay, it's threw up right there. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no, this is going AWOL. This is bad. The question is this. What was the first word revealed to the messenger? Assalamu alaikum guys and welcome back to this YouTube channel. Today we have a very special video for you because today is going to be the spicy Quran chili challenge. Okay, We're going to be asking these youngsters right here, wave to the camera, about some basic questions that they all should basically know about the Quran and of the Sunnah. Now, the way it's going to work is this. They're going to be given three rounds. The first round, they're going to be asked three questions. Now, for each question they get wrong, they're going to be having to take a chili. For the first round, we have this chili right here, which is a very hot chili sauce. The name of the first round is called the Flaming Round. And for each question they get wrong, they're going to have this very hot chili sauce going to be squirted in their mouths. The second round, they're going to be asked another three questions. And the name of that round is called the Boiling Round. For that round, they're going to be given an actual chili to bite. And this is what that chili looks like, okay? This is that chili. This is the chili that they're going to have to bite into, okay? And in just. Now, the third and final round, of course, is going to be the Jahannam Round because it's going to be the spiciest of all the peppers. And I'm not kidding with you. It is the spiciest of all peppers. And for those of you who know, they know this is indeed a habanero pepper. They're going to be given a habanero pepper to finish and complete. This is the Jahannam round. This is going to be consisting of three questions as well. Like I said, make sure you smash this video with a huge thumbs up and make sure you subscribe to this channel as well. We're about to get started now. Just like any game, there are going to be some lifelines and they're going to be three lifelines. The first lifeline, the first lifeline is going to be, they're going to be able to ask a hint from an adult behind the camera. Okay? They can use these lifelines anytime they want. But each round, they only have one lifeline. Okay. Second lifeline is going to be a glass of milk, which they get to unlock in the second round. The third and final lifeline, which is a kulfi ice cream. Okay, the third and final round is going to be a kulfi ice cream. That's how they can unlock it by asking for that help. And without any further ado, let's jump into these questions. All right, boys, you ready? You're ready, boys. Okay, first question. You cannot say the answer because someone else could cheat, steal your answer. You don't want to do that, okay? This is for the very hot chili sauce. Okay, first question for you. You ready? The question is this. What was the first word revealed to the messenger وسلم, from the angel Gabriel? That's it. One minute starts now. One minute started. What is the first word? Did you come by the image? You just had it. You just have to know. I'm sorry, guys. I can't. I'm going through that. Guys, think about it. 45 seconds left. Cats, please don't do that. Please, 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 please. Please don't do that. You got an answer? Does anyone have an answer? Okay. Emmett, your answer first, please. Okay, what is your answer, Danish? Okay, what was this? What's your answer? Okay, what was your answer? <laughs> oh, this is going to be the best part because every single one of them got it wrong. Okay, the first, the first words revealed to the Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu from the angel Gabriel was Ikra. Read. Alrighty, guys, so here's how it's going to work. Alright, let's go. Let's go. Open up. Open up. Open up. This is how it Open up! Let's go. <laughs> no, 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 I didn't do it. I didn't do it, it's not working, hold on. Okay. Hold on. Yeah, swallow, swallow. Oh, you didn't learn that. That's so oh, easy. My <laughs> guys, is... oh my god! Oh right. my god! Alright. Alright? Yo, Chavaz's face, he's already tearing up. Alrighty, it's okay. It's okay. Second question. Yeah, you remember that. Now you'll know. Alright, ready? Second question coming at you right now. What was the name of the first wife of the Prophet Muhammad? Your one minute starts now. Come back here. What was the name of the first wife of the Prophet Muhammad? Remember, you do have lifelines. Do you have an answer? Yeah. Yeah, you have an answer? Muhammad, hands down if you're done. Okay. Emmett, go for your answer. Huh? 
Aksa, that's the name of the messenger's house. Some first, I should throw this juta at you. All right, go. You go. Huh? Ikra. Okay, that's the first name. I should throw a juta at you too. What's the first? Hey, oh, hold on one second. Go for it. Huh? Layla. Okay, got you. Yeah. Oh my God. Okay, good. So here's what's gonna happen now. Once again, they have officially earned another squirt of the very hot chili sauce. Now, hold on one second. So one second. So Nay, the name of the first wife of the Messenger Salsanam is Khadija Radiallah. Well, Anha, come on, that's a basic one. All right. Come on, come on, let's go, let's go. Okay. Oh, no, this is good. I'm going to do it properly. Let's go, baby, let's go. 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 Come on. Yeah, come on, just like, open it up. You got it stuck. It's going to be stuck. Okay. <laughs> Third question, how many total chapters are in the Quran? One minute left. One minute, time starts now. How many total chapters are in Ahmed, go for your first answer. Okay. Yeah. Twenty-seven. Is that what you wrote? I'm joking. How much did you write? Ten. Okay. So, first and foremost, because he's a wise guy, he's gonna get more of this now. Okay. He's gonna definitely get more sauce. Okay. Now, here's the thing. 30, I'm going to say it's correct and correct, but oh the reason I'm correcting them is because there's 30 juz, juz of the Quran, meaning levels and separations in the Quran. There's a total of 114 chapters in the Quran. 114 chapters in the Quran, there's 30 juz. So guess what? You two, I'm going to count that. You two over here, though. Let's go. Let's go. Should have used a lifeline already. Is it, Mom? Oh, he got back. One more round, baby. Let's go. No, no, no. That's the punishment for Tenny One. Oh, yeah. Tenny One. All right. We are officially approaching round number two called the boiling round. For each question that is not answered correctly, you will be having to take a bite of this chili. Okay, chili challenge. I told you to say the game. It's the Quran chili challenge. What city was the Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam from? You have one minute. What city was the Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam from? One minute starts now. Okay, all right. You ready? Everyone has an answer. Hold on, I have a little writing. Okay. This is to avoid the chili. Okay. Emmett, answer. Okay, answer. Okay. What? This guy. This guy. Oh, okay. You want to be funny? You're being funny about the messenger sauce? You think that's a joke? Okay. Oh, man. I can't wait. Alrighty. Now, Emmett got it correct. It is Mecca. It is Mecca. Medina. Medina is the city that Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam traveled to, oh. which is a neighboring city of Mecca. But you, sir, do not have to do this, but they all do. All right. Okay. Now, we have to, don't worry, I'll take care of that. Chili, sir? Don't bite it for you yet. Here's your chili, sir. Here's your chili, sir, okay? Now, here's what we have to do. You're gonna have to take a bite that is at least, don't do that. That is at least up to here. Okay? At least up to here. And your bite starts now, please. Oh. 
Very easy. They're not too spicy. Okay. Second question. What does the word Alhamdulillah mean? Alhamdulillah mean. What does it mean? Give me your best definition of it. You have to give me a definition of it. What does Alhamdulillah mean? One minute. It starts now. Yes, you can. You have two lifelines. Which one would you like to use? Ask for help. Okay. It has to do with gratitude. Okay. Ready? We all have an answer? Okay. Emma, tell us. Okay. To show um, you have money. Okay. Um, like, huh? It means Allah is with you. Okay. Now, the word Alhamdulillah means all praise and thanks and gratitude is to Allah. Okay? So, Alhamdulillah means what? It's time for your second bite, boys. And this is your first bite. Oh, man, I was right there. All right. Now, you have to get to their level, so your bite's going to have to be a little bigger. Okay? Yeah, that's cool. All right, guys. All right. A solid, healthy bite. Bite starts now. Okay. Okay, that's gangster right there, guys. Okay. Don is not afraid. Ammon's on the level. Oh, you're almost done with the stem. <laughs> Don't worry, I got more for you. Don't worry. Don't worry, okay. Here is the third and final question of the second round called the boiling round. All right. Third and final question is this. What is... I want a definition in your best explanation possible. What is the day of judgment? What is... What is the day of judgment? One minute. Time starts. Okay, you ready? Yeah. You have something? Okay, cool. Emma, first response. <coughs> Got you. Got you. Okay. I'm not asking you when's the day of judgment. I'm saying what's the day of judgment. Okay. So a few corrections to go there. The first correction is this one: that the Prophet Muhammad saw some does not blow the trumpet. Okay, that's an angel who blows the trumpet to finish the world. Okay. Danish, what was your answer? Okay. Cool. Now the correction of that answer is that every human being doesn't matter if you're a Muslim, Jew, Christian, atheist, whatever. Every human being is judged in front of Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala for their deeds, good or bad. They're judged for everything they've done, and then they're separated into categories of heaven and into hell. Congratulations, you all got that answer correct, though. Okay, just some give or take. You have and some corrections, no problem. So, what's the scoreboard looking like? Three, two, one, one. Okay, now the next questions are going to be worth double the points. So you guys could either catch up or take the lead. Okay, so it's worth double the points. The third and final round is called the Jahannam round. All right, this is with a habanero pepper, guys. This is no joke whatsoever. Okay, you have three lifelines remaining. Officially, some of you still have a question for help. Some of you still have milk, and some of you still now officially unlocked the kulfi. All right, guys. Question number one. From round number three, the Jahannam round. First question. Who was the messenger, sallallahu alayhi wa best friend? One minute. 
Starts now. No, qu no talking. You get penalized for that. Be careful. <laughs> One minute starts now. of the messenger them, is none of you guys got it right it's Abu Bakr Sadiq guys come on <laughs> Abu Bakr Sadiq yes yes Abu Bakr Sadiq radiallahu an all right guys this is it there's a reason it's called the Jahannam round you all will be given a happy day do not eat it yet do not eat it yet do not eat it yet do not eat it yet. Alrighty guys, you're going to have to take a bite, a very healthy bite of this habanero pepper. What is the name of the best friend of the messenger's also? Uh, you will always remember it for the rest of your life. Alright guys, bismillah, go for your bite. No, no, you gotta bite it. Yeah, like that. Bite it. Like half, at least. Good half. Go ahead, take a bite. Do it. Come on, chew it up. The quicker you keep it in your mouth, the longer it Come on. Yeah. This is the real deal, guys. You can drink your milk. No, 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 I love that. I love that. <laughs> I can smell it from here. I can smell it from here, guys. It's the real deal. It's the real deal. I can smell it from here. My fingers smell. All right, second question. Second question. There's no dodging this. Name one companion of the messenger, sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. One minute starts now. Name one companion of the messenger, so I said. That's a hobby. Remember, we still have other lifelines. No! Stay where you are, stay where you are, stay where you are. Stay where you are. Here you go. Here you go. Deal. I'm telling you, this is called the Jahannam round. I was complaining. Can I use it? Okay. What's the answer? Go for Evan. Come on, my God. Abdullah. Abdullah? No, no, no. Oh, you said of a companion, right? Abdullah. Okay, go for it. Abdullah. What? No, what? Oh, my God. <laughs> mashallah, mashallah. He gets the point for that. No, because you're not being clear with what Abdullah could it be. Are there Abdullah uh, companions? Absolutely. But you have to be Abdullah what? Because there's a lot of Abdullah companions, so none of you could get it. Oh my God. Just kidding. <laughs> so, uh, so, Mohammed, you officially, that was worth twice the point, so you officially had three. So you and Emmett are tied at three while he's at two, while he's at one. Okay, third and final question, guys. Name, name, just one Islamic battle, war that took place. Come on, one minute. Name just one Islamic battle or war that took place. Your one minute starts now. Is your life What's your question? Okay, you want to help? Is that the question? Okay. Um, help is this. This was the first battle for Muslims. There was 300 Muslims there, approximately 300, a little over 300, and it starts with a B. All right, we all need a name of an Islamic war. Ahmed, start us off, please. Battle, battle of? Okay. <laughs> Go for it. <laughs> Alrighty, that's the answer. Okay, so here's what the answer is. The Battle of Badr with the, with the raw. 
It's okay. I'm gonna give you the. I'm gonna give you the opportunity though. I'm gonna let you keep that battle of mother is there, and that was worth two points. So you have a total of four points. You came in second place. He was in first place, third place, fourth place. And for now, before we continue, please finish your habanero pepper. Finish your habanero pepper. Finish your kufi habanero pepper. Take the final bite. Final bite. Let's go. Final bite. Take the bite. Take the bite. Let's go. Yes. Come on. No. Come on. Take. Chew it up. Chew it up. Let's go. Let's go. Chew it. Chew it. Chew it. Chew it. Chew it. You got this. You got this. A few moments later. This is bad. This is really bad. All right. I think. I think. I think this is where the video has to be finished up. Right now. Are you still? Are you still like throwing up right there? Can I see the vomit, please? Okay, that is disgusting. All right. All right, boys. Here's where it all ends, all right? Well, guys, that was the video. I hope that you enjoyed it. If you did enjoy from this video, please make sure you smash this video with a huge thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe to the channel as well. These guys are champions, but it also teaches us that we need to engage with our youth more, teach our children more, and not just like send them to schools and stuff and expect them to learn. We need to actually quiz them and see if they know what they're talking about. He needs to clean this up with the hose because that is disgusting right there. And until next time, also drop any feedback, comments, questions, what questions would you like to ask children? Tell me in the comment section below. I read and respond to every single question. And until next time, we're out. Say bye-bye. 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 We're all out of here. <laughs> okay. So the gift was never given to Amber. That that's what we're going to do right now, okay? Come, come, come. Where's Amber? Where's Where's Emmett? Emmett, where are you? Emmett, you're down there? Mm -hmm. Emmett, do you remember the, the Quran chili challenge? Do you remember yeah. us doing that? Yeah. Oh, you might want to pause the game. You might have to. You might have to pause the game. You can't? It's okay, it's okay. So do you remember the Quran chili challenge, yeah? He's yeah. playing some FIFA, yeah? Do you remember who won? No, I don't. You don't, right? You basically beat Muhammad at the end, and you won by answering the Battle of Badr. You don't remember? You don't remember? So I was supposed to, I said something about giving you a gift. You don't, do you remember that? No. No? Okay, well, you were supposed to get a gift. I think you must have given me one. No, I didn't give it to you. I'm giving it to you now. You ready? You ready for the gift? There you go. I can't take it. Bro, what are you talking about? This is your gift. This is your gift. Bro, you ate all that chili. This is your gift. This is your gift. Take it. Take it from my hand. Take it from my hand. Take it from my hand. This is your gift, sir. This is your, this is your... Some AirPods. Daddy, do you remember? Thank you. No problem, bro. Like, that's it. Just don't be awkward about it. You just put one down. He doesn't even want them. He doesn't even want them, man. Come on now.